How's it going everyone? It is me, Lone Vault Wanderer. Just a quick video on Borderlands 3 today. I'm super tired after yesterday's video. I was up to 3 a.m. making it. But before we get started on this one, as always, I would love if you followed and supported me on Twitch. The link to my Twitch is in the description below, as is the link to my Discord, and I would love to see you there too. So Gearbox Software, the developer behind the Borderlands series, of course, is currently hiring for something. They have a few job listings on their website. I will show you those on the screen right now. I'll also link it in the description below, just in case any of you are interested in working at Gearbox. But the one that's most interesting is the position of writer. If you click on the page, it says the following. Gearbox is looking for someone to join the writing team for an unannounced AAA FPS slash RPG hybrid with strong characters and central narrative thread. The successful candidate will join the writing team to write, punch up, and iterate scripts in line with established story and plot outlines. Responsibilities will include writing dialogue for voiceover and in-game text for missions, flavor, and user interfaces. A love for comedy writing with respect for a serious underlying plot is helpful. The ability to work with a team and to accept notes, criticism, and the iterative process is a must. Then at least a bunch of required skills, and probably the ones that are most interesting, is the demonstrable skill in writing entertaining and engaging dialogue with meaningful character interactions, strong passion and demonstrable ability for comedic or satiric writing, and published work in video games. So I think we can be all but sure, all but certain, that this is relating to Borderlands 3. I've made so many videos on how Randy Pitford has hinted and pretty much confirmed, all but confirmed, that Gearbox's next game is Borderlands 3. And we know that 90% plus of the studio is working on the game. So the likelihood is that all of these positions that Gearbox is hiring for, including this writing position, are all for Borderlands 3. And you can see the clear indicators of that in this specific job listing. It's an unannounced AAA FPS slash RPG hybrid with strong characters, a central narrative. It has comedy writing, but a serious underlying plot. This without a doubt in my mind is relating to Borderlands 3. And if anything, all this does is just further confirm that yes, this is Gearbox's next game. Like we even needed any extra confirmation, but it's there at the very least. I saw a number of articles about this job listing today, all of which are relatively gun shy in wanting to absolutely confirm that this is relating to Borderlands 3. But I'm gonna say this is relating to Borderlands 3. Gearbox next game is Borderlands 3. There is no other game that this could possibly be. That's me putting my neck out there, but I'm sick of saying that, oh, Gearbox's next game could be Borderlands 3. All these job listings could be for another game. It's for Borderlands 3. Let's just accept that as a reality and move forward with our lives and have a nice dinner and drink some wine because that's what we need to do. That's what I need to do now because I'm fucking tired. I stayed up to 3 a.m. last night and I'm going crazy. But seriously, this is great news. I can't wait to hear more officially about Borderlands 3. God knows when that's happening. I made a video about my predictions for its release date and its official announcement date. I'll link that in the description below if I remember, if I'm not too tired. But yeah, that's all I wanted to talk about, Way Sanders. I would love to get your thoughts about this in the comments below. Do you see any other secrets or hints or Easter eggs in this particular job listing? Is there something that I missed that might suggest something about the next Borderlands game? I mean, I guess the only thing is about this upcoming game having a serious underlying plot. Now, to an extent, Borderlands has always had a somewhat loosely serious plot, but it's been obviously implanted with comedic themes. But we do know that Randy Pitford has said in the past that Borderlands 3 is going to be closer to Borderlands 1 than to Borderlands 2. And in my mind, Borderlands 1 was a much more reserved, serious, wastelandy game than Borderlands 2, which was over the top with crazy characters. And that was great for what it was, but it seems maybe this could be another indicator that Borderlands 3 is taking a more serious approach with its storytelling and its narrative. And it's going to be interesting to see how that is actually borne out and how much comedic value this game will have because I hope it does. I hope it's still a fun game to play. I hope it still has funny characters, over-the-top storylines and side quests. I don't necessarily want a super serious Borderlands game. I think a large part of Borderlands 2's success was because of its over-the-top nature. So hopefully Gearbox balances the two nicely. So I'd love to get your thoughts on that as well and until next time this has been the lone vault wanderer please take care of yourself and would you kindly keep buying the good fight